Grace, grace and peace be unto you from God our Father and the Lord Jesus Christ. This is Dudley Weaver with an Advent Reflection for Wednesday, the 13th of December. Our reading for today is one of my favorites from the prophet Isaiah. Comfort. O comfort my people, says your God. Speak tenderly to Jerusalem and cry to her that she has served her term, that her penalty is paid, that she has received from the Lord's hand double for all her sins. A voice cries out, In the wilderness prepare the way of the Lord, make straight in the desert a highway for our God. Every valley shall be lifted up, and every mountain and hill be made low. The uneven ground shall become level, and the rough places a plain. Then the glory of the Lord shall re be revealed, and all people shall see it together. For the word of the Lord has spoken. Comfort. It is more than a wish here. It is more than a greeting. Have yourself a merry little Christmas. Let your hearts be light. This is a declaration of God's purpose and intention. Forgiveness is granted. Deliverance from captivity is at hand. Even now it is on the horizon. Get ready. Pack your bags. You're going home. But the one who is to proclaim this, me this message objects. Nothing's going to change, Lord. Words, they're just words. Why get these people's hopes up? They will only be disappointed again. Good news is sometimes hard for us to believe. We grow so accustomed to things as they are that we give up hope of their ever being changing, being any changes. We make our peace and resign ourselves to whatever exile has been thrust upon us. A job you cannot stand, a bad marriage or no marriage at all, an addiction whose clutches cut deep into your being, a difficult or handicapped child. Comfort? What comfort? Hoping for something more is just an exercise in futility, we think, if we do not say. God's comfort, though, is more than a wish. It is a command. The declaration carries with it the power of its own fulfillment. God himself will come among his people with power and with might to set aside whatever obstacles may remain in the path to freedom. And God himself will lead them home as a shepherd tends, cares, and leads his flock. Comfort. Remember, it is more than a wish. It is more than hopeful thinking. It is a declaration of God's purpose. God's purpose in your life, and he is at work even in this day to bring comfort to your soul, comfort to your life. May God bless you this day and every day, and thank you as always for listening on this Wednesday.